Camera talking about buying child pornography is now in jail. Eric Spoltholz was booked into the Blanco County Jail. He's charged with possession of child pornography. KXAN investigator Kylie McGivern first brought us a story last week. She joins us live from the sheriff's office with this update. Kylie. Well, Robert and Sydney, a search warrant for Spoltz to Holtz's home talks about taking everything from computers to cameras and a phone. And we sat down with the district attorney to talk about this case and where it stands. It was evidence Austin police obtained, including this video that ended in Eric Spoltaholt's arrest. Well, what you are, one or two of Those pictures of the, of the kid. And how much money did you send this woman in all? I know. Oh, probably over $700. And you told her certain things that you want from her? The, yeah, yeah. The results led to the investigation in Blanco County, which is one of the counties in my district. We asked District Attorney Sonny McAfee if the woman you can hear asking questions in the video is also part of the investigation. And unfortunately, I can't talk about who might be a witness, who might not be a witness or involved in the investigation other than the agencies involved. According to a search warrant, the woman described another instance from 18 years ago to police when Spoltaholtz allegedly played a sexual video of a young girl with an adult male and later on had concerns he may be attracted to her own teenage daughter. It is critical for leadership at APD, AFD, and at the top of the city, myself, that ensures that these things do not happen again. Spoltaholtz was with the Austin Fire Department more than 20 years before retiring last week, the same time the allegations came to light. We asked City Manager Spencer Kronk about the city's involvement. We are doing everything that we need to do to cooperate that and investigating that as thoroughly as possible and as quickly as possible. Cooperation that led to a case the DA feels confident about. Their, one, knowledge of the facts, knowledge of the material, as well as Blanco County's uh, officers that are very knowledgeable in this area, has just been invaluable to putting this investigation together. And Austin Fire Chief Rhoda Mae Kerr, she released a statement today calling the allegations shocking and definitely not in alignment with AFD's values. She says the department is fully cooperating with this investigation, and the DA says that there could be charges beyond just that of child pornography. Back to you.